Okay, so here I have Sophia. The reason why I have her open is because the playback on this walk cycle is ridiculously slow. It's uh, 10 frames per second, and that's something that leads to bottlenecks and all sorts of bad habits. So let's remedy that. More often than not, characters end up in this stage if we're not very careful of the polygon count on the assets. There are many implementations on how you can solve this. A lot of rigs have switches for different resolutions. The way I like to handle this has to do with replacing the files fast and slow. If I jump over to the file where this rig is currently constructed, what I see once I turn off statistics here is that we are currently at around 100,000 triangles. That's beyond what my computer can handle. I'm going to open up this in the explorer and if i take a look at my file path you'll see that the folder that i'm currently at is called high it's very conscious if i go one folder up you'll see one called low and inside there's pretty much a copy of the same file so what is this file if i open this file what you see is the same rig that i had before but if we turn on again statistics we have significantly less triangles. In fact, what we have here is a proxy version that has about a third of the polygons. And all I did to get there was just to decimate this mesh. For example, this jacket, we have a decimated version and here we have the high poly version. The way that looks is simply come in here and add in decimate. I'll move this on top of the rig. And what I like to do is to drop it all the way down and then increase it until I see some detail. That's 0.1 and click on apply. And what I have is this proxy version. The formations aren't gonna be good, but I am gonna get a lighting fast rig for animating. So I come and all the big pieces of geo that slow down this rig, I try to decimate the jacket, the pants. If there's something like the belt that's not necessary, I turn that off. These little bracelets here, I just delete them. And what this gives me is a very fast version of the rig. How fast? Well, if I come back here and I replace this rig with the proxy version, I'll go here to Blender File, and this linked file, I'm gonna click on relocate. The magic behind this is that I just need to change this high to low, click on relocate file, and it's gonna relink it. Now when I hit play, we're getting 24 frames per second on a rig that previously was at 10. Now, again, the deformations aren't as clean as the high resolution version, and this animation is really basic, but hopefully you can see how this speeds up drastically the animation process.